Now, new at 11, one grandmother's warning about a popular toy. Yeah, it's called the fidget spinner, and it's very popular among young children. Channel 2's Tom Jones, live in Midtown Atlanta. Tom, she said the toy fell apart into tiny pieces. That's right. This is the fidget spinner that three year old Cooper was playing with in the back seat of his grandmother's uh, car. His mother noticed that it began to come apart and it left a small battery in the child's hand. That's when the grandmother thought, hey, this may be dangerous for small children. You just spin them. It is the hottest toy on the market. They're hard to find. They're hard to find. Children like three year old Cooper just love the fidget spinner. But Cooper's grandmother says the toy could be dangerous for small children. Parents need to be really aware. Teresa Casterson says she had just bought Cooper the fidget spinner, and Cooper and his mother were riding with her in the car. He was playing with it going down the road. Then Cooper's mother noticed the spinner had come apart, and Cooper had the parts in his hand. Including this small battery that lights up. Casterson says Cooper could have easily put it in his mouth. He could have choked, and especially a battery. You know, he had a battery in his hand that could have gone in his mouth and choked him. Casterson and Cooper's mother became very concerned. They say there's no choking hazard warning on the box, no age limit warning, or nothing that says it comes apart. And if it's going to come apart, they need to have a warning on the box that it may. Cause choking, you know, not for children under three. Casterson says the spinner used to keep Cooper busy, but not anymore. He loves the spinner. So, but he can't have it. And Casterson said she posted on social media about this incident, and others said that it fell apart on them as well. That's why she's urging parents to be extra careful if your child has one of these. We're live in Midtown Atlanta. Tom Jones, Channel 2 Action News, Night Beat.